The whole point of this Mars 500 experiment is to test how people stand up under the conditions that you might expect in a real mission to Mars. So you're talking about being away for at least a year and a half, uh, of being in a tiny spacecraft with just a few other people and not really having any immediate communication back with Earth because of the time it takes for your radio signal to get back home. So far it seems as though the volunteers in this experiment have done very well. They've performed all of the tasks that they've been given, they've dealt with the artificial crises that were engineered to test their stress levels and they don't seem to have had major, major arguments with each other. We're learning more and more about Mars all of the time. We have a fleet of robotic craft in orbit and even down on the surface and we're going to see more and more exciting results from those over the next few years. But there are some things where you really need to have a person there who can make snap decisions and investigate things on the hoof and, and I think until we can send people there, there there are going to be some mysteries about Mars that we won't be able to solve. Test, please switch on the ventilation system.